Hello listeners and welcome to Daily Current Affairs Quiz 4th September 2022. This is your RJ Priyanka and without any further delay we begin our today's quiz. So the first question for today's quiz is Which of the following country launched the world's first hydrogen powered train fleet? The correct answer for the question is Germany has launched the world's first fleet of hydrogen powered passenger trains according to reports 14 trains with hydrogen fuel cell drive produced by french manufacturer alstom are to replace diesel trains let's move further to question number 2 for two railway projects which of the following country signed two consultancy contracts with india the correct answer for the question is Bangladesh and India signed two contracts for the construction of a new broad gauge line between Khulna Darsana and conversion of meter gauge line into a dual gauge line between Parbatipur and Konya. Let's move further to question number 3. Which of the following bank launched the Kochi One card campaign? The correct answer for the question is Access Bank which partnered with Kochi Metro Rail Limited KMRL in 2016 to enable cashless commute in the metro has announced offers for Kochi One smart card holders in connection with Onam. Let's move further to question number 4. To achieve net zero operational carbon emissions by 2046 Which of the following company announced to invest rupees 2 lakh crore? The correct answer for the question is Indian Oil Corporation IOC has unveiled a rupees 2 lakh crore roadmap to achieve net zero greenhouse gas emission from its operations by 2046. Let's move further to question number 5. Under 17 Women's World Cup 2022 will be hosted by which of the following country in October 2022 The correct answer for the question is India's three group matches in the FIFA Under 17 Women's World Cup 2022 in October will be held at the Kalinga Stadium in Bhubaneswar This is the second FIFA competition hosted by India in recent years Let's move further to question number 6. A new book titled India's Economy from Nehru to Modi: A Brief History was authored by which of the following author? The correct answer for the question is A new book named India's Economy from Nehru to Modi: A Brief History written by Pulapre Balakrishnan will be launched later this month. Let's move further to question number 7. Which of the following state signed an MOU with Parley for the Oceans for Plastic Waste Management? The correct answer for the question is Andhra Pradesh government entered into a memorandum of understanding MOU with the US based Parley for the Oceans on Plastic Waste Management in state. Let's move further to question number 8. Dash inaugurated the 8th India International MSME Startup Expo and Summit at New Delhi. The correct answer for the question is Lieutenant Governor of Jammu and Kashmir Manoj Sinha inaugurated the 8th India International MSME Startup Expo 2022 at Pragati Maidan New Delhi. Let's move further to question number 9. Who among the following took charges as interim president of the Indian Olympic Association IOA The correct answer for the question is The Indian Olympic Association has co-opted Adil Sumariwala as the president of the association till fresh elections are held Let's move further to the 10th and last question for today's quiz Which Indian cricketer became the leading run scorer in men's T20 internationals? The correct answer for the question is Indian skipper Rohit Sharma overtook New Zealand's Martin Guptill to become the leading run scorer in men's T20 internationals. 
So with this question we have now come to an end of today's episode of Daily Current Affairs Quiz 4th September 2022. Please stay tuned for more learning. This is Raj Priyanka signing off. Thank you.